Hi Boca Raton, this is City Councilman Scott Singer coming at you with the last Boca Beat of 2017. Hope everyone had a Merry Christmas. The last big event in our city was last week. The Boca Raton Bowl attracted nearly 1.5 million viewers on primetime TV. A great experience for our hometown FAU Owls, but also a great experience for our entire city because that sort of exposure for our city helps us attract businesses. It's a small component of our overall economic development strategy, which in 2017 paid some huge dividends. I'm happy to share that over the last seven years our city has created or retained nearly 10,000 high-paying jobs and the most recent coup was the retention and expansion of a core company modernizing medicine homegrown in Boca Raton when a few months ago the governor came by to announce the largest job expansion in Palm Beach County in the last eight years. More than 900 jobs will be created over the coming years all here in Boca Raton. That's huge for our city and has a huge impact on residents' lives as those high paying jobs attract other businesses, help fuel our economy, help find new home buyers, and help preserve our high quality of life. I'm happy to highlight that as one of the many successes our city had in 2017. Looking at a bigger picture at our overall budget, we maintained the lowest millage rate of any full service city in Palm Beach County and yet expanded vital services in so many areas. We're creating a culture of innovation within city government and we've now added a new innovation officer and a sustainability officer, along with dozens more employees from parks to code enforcement to public safety, all to preserve the look and feel of our safe community. And speaking of safety, we had high marks again in 2017 with the best in public safety. We owe a great deal to the brave men and women who serve in our police and fire rescue departments. They keep our city world class and we're so grateful for them. When they achieve best in class ratings in both police and fire rescue year after year, including a coveted rating that less than one half of 1% of all fire departments have in the United States, you know we're doing things well in Boca Raton. And we'll keep trying to do them well in all areas in Boca. Just rounding out the year and what else we did? Well, we expanded green space significantly or we're continuing with work at Hillsborough Real Park, our waterfront master plan, which I highlighted last episode, and on expanding our public golf offerings by partnering with the Beach and Park District to create a Boca National Golf Course, a public course over at the old Ocean Breeze site. We are now in contract to sell the Western Golf Course, which hopefully upon sale will result in $65 million in the city coffers, a new public golf course within Boca Raton, and a whole range of activities to improve our infrastructure with that money. From our master plan at City Hall to roadway improvements in a lot of neighborhoods through our downtown, Glades Road, and I-95 at Spanish River. A lot happened this year, but I want to hear from you on what you'd like to see happen in 2018. We'll keep working to provide the best in public safety and low cost services, but I need to have your feedback on how I can better serve you. So stay in touch here with me at the Boca Voice or Scott Singer USA. Enjoy the rest of 2017 and wishing you an early, happy and healthy new year. Thanks.